from its first steps in the region of Caucasus in the 7th century and fighting a war with the Turkics to becoming a superpower in the country and reigning over the lives of more than 10% of the population. Islam has come a long way in the Russian Federation. Currently, there are four mosques in Moscow, the capital of Russia, and over 8,000 praying centers established all over the country. Islam is the second largest religion in Russia, and it is mainly comprised in seven states. Today, we'll be elaborating the story of the seven states. 1. Ingushetia is a Russian republic with a population of an estimated 330,000, of which 96% are Muslims. The state proclaimed Islam as its primary religion in the 19th century. Previously, the English practiced Christianity and used to be pagans. Today, the state follows the Chechen preacher Kunta Haji and practices the Shafi'i school of thought with Sufism. Ingushetia has the largest population of Muslims in the Russian Federation, and most of them dress similar to the Muslims in Indonesia and Malaysia. Mahmoud Ali Kalimatov heads the state of Ingushetia and is a practicing Muslim. 2. Chechnya Chechnya is one of the largest Islamic states in Russia and was actually proclaimed as an Islamic Republic in 1997. Ramadan Kadyrov, the head, has memorized the Holy Qur'an and continues to preside over the state as a hard-line protector of Muslim rights. Although the state's head has come under fire for regulating tough laws, the state itself is known for its diversity in food and scenic beauty. Chechen Muslims primarily follow the Shafi'i school of thought. 3. kabardino balkaria kabardino balkaria is a federal subject of Russia and is best known for its scenic beauty. Kabardino is home to the highest mountain in Europe, Mount Elbrus, and a population of approximately 900,000, of which 70% are Muslims. The Kabards and the Balkars of the region were among the last of the North Caucasian people to be converted to Islam and today they primarily follow Sunni Islam. The head of the republic Kazbek Kokov oversees the legal and religious affairs. 4. Karachai Cherkessia is a federal state of the North Caucasus region of Russia. It boasts a population of half a million people, of which 64% are Muslims. The state republic is one of the most religious regions in Russia, and they have been known to spend their lives practicing spirituality. Until the 17th century, Karachais were primarily Orthodox Christians. Then the Crimean Tatars arrived, and the Circassian Turks stayed until the mid-18th century. They were Muslims, and their influence led the Karachais to accept Islam. Today, just 14% of Karachai Cherkessia are Orthodox Christians. Their leader, Rashid Tamrezov, has established many rules to balance the religious nature of the Karachais but it's yet to be known whether he, too, is a practicing Muslim. 5. Bakhortostan, or Bashkiriya, is a large federal republic of Russia, and it is located between the Ural Mountains and the Volga River. The beautiful nature is home to around 5 million people, of which 60% are Muslims. Islam was introduced in the region around the 10th century by the Volga Bulgars. A minority of population of Russian Orthodox Christians also live in the Republic of Bakhortostan, and they comprise around 17% of the total population. The native Muslim Bashkirs primarily speak Turkic, influenced by their own history with the Turks. The Republic of Bashkiriya is presided by Radi Khabirov, and he has been known to respect Islam. 6. Tartarstan is another large federal republic of Russia. It has a population of nearly 4 million people, which mainly comprises Tatars and Bashkirs. Influenced heavily by the arrival of the Turks in the late 10th century, the region converted to Islam and followed the ways of the Turkic people.
Around 55% of the population of Tatarstan is Muslim. The other half are Russian Orthodox Christians. Given the massive number of both religions, everyone has the freedom to practice their religion openly. There are masjids on every corner of Tatarstan, and beside them stands a church. The balance is beautiful. 7. Dagestan is one of the oldest Russian republic with a Muslim majority. With a population of approximately 4 million, Dagestanis enjoy diversity to its fullest. There are multiple ethnicities in the region, all of whom speak different dialects, but are united under Islam. Dagestan is also known as a mountain of language and nationalities. Around 90% of the Republic of Dagestan follows Islam, and the rest practice Orthodox Christianity. The famous mixed martial artist, Khabib Nurmagomedov, hails from the public of Dagestan and is a devout Muslim. He has inspired millions around the world with his kind attitude, gentle manners, and respect. This concludes our story of the seven Islamic states of Russia. Muslims may comprise only 10% of the population of Russia, but their influence is larger than any other religion in the country. From the heads of the states to the citizens of the republics, everyone makes sure to practice Islam thoroughly and inspire others to do so as well. There aren't many converts to Islam, and most of the Muslims are natives to the federal states. This is primarily because rejecting state orthodox still isn't met well in the country. Converts to Islam are shunned or forced to exile to different countries. However, Islam continues to grow in Russia, given the high birth rate, and with the will of Allah, Muslims may see a better future in the country. May Allah Almighty safeguard the Muslims in Russia, bless them with mercy, and keep them steadfast under Iman. Ameen.